What's up, YouTube? This is Cody Four Man Two Two One, and we are doing COD Four. I'm using an RPD with red dot side stopping power, deep impact, and I forget what my first perk is. Actually, I'm sure you can rewind the video at the very front and see what it is. I'm actually, I have trouble remembering what the blue perks are. It's like, well, I can't remember. Oh, RPGs. There we go. I have RPGs down there. So, as you can see, we have a, a little guy, a little guy modding COD Four on the left and I, I don't mind if they do it like it goes two times or whatever but if it keeps constantly going the whole game it's really annoying so I'm actually getting some nice RPD kills the thing about you gotta realize that LMGs in this game they're meant for long range they can like like look watch this kill that was like a sniper kill right there these things have really long range and this whole team gets completely spawn trapped this game. It was really fun. But I can't imagine being on the other team. So I almost got my airstrike there, but I got killed. By Unbound Silly Fly Kid. That's an interesting gamer tag. So I've been playing some more COD 4. I really like when I get into games and no one's modding. It's just for the pure sport. Well, it's, I guess you wouldn't really call it a sport, but it's just for the pure entertainment and it's not like modders because Infinity War is not going to do anything about this. Okay, every time I go to multiplayer there's like an it says um something about Infinity Award servers aren't working or something. So I'm trying to post up because I know they're all spawning back there. And this is how you properly spawn trap. You don't go too far into their spawn to stop them. Like you don't go too far in and get killed. You gotta kinda sit on the background out here. I realize that the right side is probably not the best angle to get some kills. So later I'll move on to the left side. That guy is juggernaut threw a grenade at me. And I got noob too, but no big deal. So I'm using the RPD with desert camo. In this game, oh, there's also someone way outside the map. Probably that mod guy. If you look on my mini map, way outside the map. Now I'm going to run in here and try to spray and get noob tube again. Um, what else? Let's see. The RPD, there's three LMGs in this game. The RPD, the SAW, and the M40A3. No, um, yeah, it's like the big LMG gun that could, it's like used for anti-air stuff. And that guy was in our spawn and tried to get his team out of a spawn trap very boldly. Pretty brave, but dumb, because we we're easy to come back. And somehow one of them got a five kill streak. I don't believe that. Tell me if you do want to see more Call of Duty 4 gameplay. Look, I, I got sniped by that guy right there. I'm surprised that one didn't get a kill there, too. So, I'm now 7 and 5. You know, I'm checking my score because this is shot live. My chair's being squeaky. I shot this live. I didn't do a live commentary. I'm still not sure because my my de uh, my HP PVR. Get drop shot. And my HD PVR. I actually shoots in widescreen, but for some reason Power Director isn't like saving it in widescreen for some reason. Like I open up it as a WMB and it's completely widescreen. It looks nice. So now I've kind of pushed it out a little bit. I think that should be okay for YouTube. Otherwise, you know, I just gotta I just gotta mix the right settings here. And as you can see, I'm just continuing to spawn kill. That's what sucks is that um, on some maps in Black Ops like Summit, you can really easily spawn trap them at A and then they're just dead the whole game. And when we look at some of their scores, some guy went like 3 and 29. I probably would have left the game. I would never do that to my KD. Like I don't mind going like negative 15 or whatever, getting the objectives and capping flags and stuff and being a good team player. But sometimes you're not even going to like, look at me shooting that guy through the window. Sometimes you're not going to be able to, like, go positive, and then you have to sometimes camp to go positive. As you can see, I'm just we're just abusing the spawn trap here, and I'm waiting for my airstrike to come in. So I'm going to get back because I know I'm on a five kill streak. Call the airstrike right on there. Hopefully, get my chopper. And you think calling it right over there? I think the farmhouse stopped it and stuff. And I'm also, I might also do, I don't know, just for fun, I have, I know how to get on every rooftop of backlot in this game, on old school mode, 
kind of some fun little glitches I can maybe show you how to do if you guys are interested. Then we've also got that Modern Warfare 2 Spec Ops series. I do have some very interesting ones I beat on that and it's split screen so you can see both players and give you some advice on that stuff. One more kill and I get my chopper. Will I get it? I run out. I run back. They're throwing grenades at me. I pull out my pistol. Grab the M16, crouch, try to knife him, and he knifed me. So there goes my kill streak. It's because I didn't reload, and these things are so annoying to reload if you don't have sleight of hand. But that gets rid of stopping power, and it's definitely not worth it. Look at this guy, where I'm just shooting all these bullets. I also have another gameplay on COD 4 with no hackers on. Look at this guy just walking right in front of me. It's um shipment and oh my gosh that map is so fun. You know I'm also using deep impact and I'm surprised like I had to watch the kill cam like look at this. I'm like spraying all his bullets and he was like one two three kill me with his USP. So there's all my bullets in the thing. I don't know COD four was the first <clears throat> was the first Call of Duty I ever played. I, like it was the first one I really got competitive online. I did Call of Duty 3 online. As you saw, I did a, a one versus one sniper thing yesterday, <laughs> and I threw that grenade back because martyred him, and it bounced off the wall and exploded next to me. Like everyone was playing Call of Duty 4. Like before Modern Warfare 2 came out, like there was only World at War, and that was that's kind of fun online. I do like enjoy. I do enjoy playing that a little bit. But I mean, Call of Duty 4 was the stuff that really that made Infinity Awards stand out versus Treyarch. Because I don't know if you guys agree with this, but I look forward a lot more to the Infinity Award Call of Duties and the and the Treyarch Call of Duties. Treyarch just makes their Call of Duties a little bit different. I feel like Infinity Award, you know, it's more like Modern Warfare Infinity Award. Like, I mean, we don't always want. Look at this triple feed right there. Quad feed. That was a quad. That was nice. Um, we always don't want balanced guns. Like, I'm sure we all like. No matter how many people complain about, it, I'm sure in Modern Warfare 2 we all like the ACR or use it at some point or the UMP. Like, there needs. It shouldn't be completely balanced. There should be guns that are better than others. And this game, the MP5, was definitely a really good gun. That was like the SMG. You get a lot of kills on the mini Uzi too, if you wanted. And then there's no kill streaks in this game. You know what's funny is that Treyarch copied Infinity Award on World at War. They had like the same perks except different names. Like Spy Plane was UAV, and then on Black Ops they call it Spy Plane again when we know it's like UAV. And I wasn't exactly sure. I haven't been to that part of the map in a while. And you can act, they actually spawn in their little shed. So I'm gonna run over here and not let them get out of their little spawn trap. They're like trapped prisoners trying to get away. This guy's crawling in the grass, hit fire, and kill a little level one guy. Another triple feed. And then um yeah, if you get three kills in this game, you get automatically the UAV. It's your kill streak, sorry. Automatically radar UAV, airstrike, and then helicopter. Oh by the way, it's kind of funny. A lot of my good gameplays are on maps I do not like. And Downpour was not the map I like the best. So the gameplay was wrapping up to an end here. Tell me what you think of Call of Duty 4 and if you want to see some glitches. Final score 13 to 13. If you want to see some glitches, some more gameplay. And then that sniper montage will be out probably in October or maybe late September. Because I've got to get all these clips and make them good and not make it like other stuff. Anyway, this is Call of Duty for Man 221 signing off. Hope you enjoyed.